The Cura has the following features. Vango Lifetime Guarantee. Fire retardant fly sheet, inner tent, mesh and ground sheet reduce the possibility of ignition from naked flames. Protex 3000 polyester fly sheet, durable, totally waterproof and resistant to colour fade. Power Plus steel poles for a reliable form structure which performs well in all weathers. Powerflex fiberglass poles, tough, sturdy and reliable. Fly sheet first pitching keeps the inner tents dry. Sewn in ground sheet, fully enclosed to protect against drafts and bugs. Mesh vents on inners allow continual airflow. Matching accessories include sleeping bags, furniture, wind brakes and sun canopies. Case bag for ease of packing and transport. Assemble the poles and lay them on the ground. The Cura 600 has two curved steel poles, two long and two medium fiberglass poles and a stretcher pole with flat ends. The Cura 800 DLX has an additional curved steel pole. The fiberglass poles are colour coded to match the corresponding pole sleeve entry points. Open out the fly sheet and position it in the required direction. Insert the curved steel poles through the pole sleeves with the black tabs. Starting on one side of the tent, loosen the tension straps located along the ground sheet and place the metal pin into the end of the corresponding steel pole. On the other side of the tent, push the pole into the pole sleeve and place the metal pin into the end. Remove any slack in the pole sleeve by pulling on the tension strap. This ensures that the pins don't pop out of the poles accidentally. Place the tent so that all the poles are facing in the same direction, with the ends of the poles pointing towards the front of the tent. Push any remaining steel poles into an arch and connect them to the pin and ring system. Move all the steel poles so that they sit on top of each other. Next, peg out the two corners at the front of the tent using V-channel pegs, ensuring that the door is facing in the desired direction. With one person at each side of the tent, gather up all the steel poles and position them from front to back into a tunnel shape. Make sure that the tent is positioned in a straight line, with the poles positioned the correct distance apart. Peg the two rear corners using V-pegs and tighten up the tension straps. One bedroom at a time, insert the blue and grey poles into the relevant sleeves. On each pole, follow the seam down to connect the ends onto the correct pins. Peg out each bedroom using steel V-pegs. It's helpful for two people to peg out each bedroom to ensure that it's pegged at the correct angle. Next, clip the fly sheet to all the steel and fiberglass poles using the plastic clips. Tighten any loose tension straps at the base of each pole. At this stage, it's a good idea to check the sewn-in ground sheet to ensure that the tent has been pitched in a straight line. If any creases or folds are visible, realign the poles to suit. Peg out each pole using a pin peg through the metal ring. Peg and tighten any remaining tension straps at the doors and at the rear of the bedrooms. 
Insert the steel stretcher pole into the holders inside the tent. Extend the end and lock it in place. Untie and peg out all the guy lines. Guy lines attached to poles should be pegged parallel to the direction of the pole. Open out the inner tents inside the fly sheet and position the doorways to correspond with the living area. The middle toggle will be colour coded to correspond with the correct positioning. Starting from the rear corners of the tent, attach the elasticated hooks on the ground sheet to the corresponding rings on the fly sheet anchor straps. Suspend the inner by attaching the toggles of the inner tent through the rings on the inside of the fly sheet. Do the rear first and work towards the porch. Attach the base of the pelmet to the attachment point on the front of the inner. Taking the tent down is the reverse of putting it up. Remove the inner tent. Remove the stretcher pole. Unpeg the guy lines. Unpeg all the bedroom areas. Push the bedroom poles out of the sleeves. Unpeg the main tent. Release the pins from the steel poles. Push the poles out of the sleeves. Fold the inners and fly sheet to fit the bag and pack away.